No, I'm over here. Teak, good girl, come over here. Come on, come over here. Come on, come on. Good girl, good, good. This is Tiki and she's one of our most favorite residents. She's a Brazilian tapir. And the reason I'm doing this is for a couple of reasons. Firstly, it gets her used of us tactiling her, so touching her. So it's a good way for us to check if she's got any fleas or ticks or anything. One, and two, she loves it. You can see she loves it. Um, another good reason is it allows us to touch her feet and things and check if she's got any foot problems. Um, and that just helps with husbandry in general, having an animal that's so tactile. And this is also a really, really good opportunity for me. We have a lot of flies around. She doesn't like the flies, so this is Repellex. This is another good opportunity for me to apply the Repellex to her as well and keep the flies off her. You'll notice that she will now lie down. Sit, Teak. Good. She has no problems lying down. And again, this is a good way to get in here and check her belly. She loves her belly rubbed, as most people do and most animals do. Oh yeah. Good girl. What a good girl you are. Hey, what a good girl. And you clean those eyes. Clean those dirty eyes. That's my girl. And brush all those flies off you. Hey, she gets quite dry skin too, so it's just a good way to just, you know, get everything off. In, in um, winter when she doesn't use her pond as much, we also have to cover her in an oil, like a QV oil, sort of oil of land for tapirs basically. So, and that just maintains her skin to be nice and moist still, so it does dry out a bit. So maintaining this behavior even throughout summer, even though she's using the pond, it then allows us in winter when we do have to oil her down with a QV oil, it, it, it allows us to do that without her thinking something different or news going on. I'll give her one last spray of Repellex just to make sure I got her all over. Obviously when I'm spraying this I don't want to spray it too close to her face. Anyone that's used insect repellent knows that it's pretty smelly and uh, you don't want it in your eyes or around your mouth so that's why I'm spraying it on the brush first and then just brushing around her face. Good girl. One last foot, one last foot teak. That's my girl. And Tiki we're going to say finish now. 